The swipe through helps improve your fluidity, your flow, and your smoothness in flair bartending. It's a fundamental move to learn, to add to your repertoire, and today I'm gonna to take you through some of the basics leading up to some of the more difficult moves. So stick around until the end, grab your bottle and tin, and let's get going. So let's start simple with the simple swipe through. Grab hold of your bottle in tennis grab like so, and the cocktail shaker in beer grab like this. Start by learning to throw the shaker up and catch it in the same hand like this. Now using your elbow as the center of the circle, make circular motions with the bottle like so. And as you start swinging that around, bring that arm on top of the shaker arm, then throw the shaker up, swipe through with the bottle and catch the shaker again in that same hand. Repeat this move over and over so you can get used to how it feels, you can improve your style, improve your smoothness and get better at performing this move. Now we'll start to throw the bottle. So we're gonna learn how to throw flat without any spin. So you're gonna throw the bottle, let go of it and grab it like so. So do this a few times so you can learn this part of the move. And then the shaker part is exactly the same. So you start slow and then build the shaker into the swipe through and build up until you get the rhythm. And again, continue doing that move over and over until you can get a click of the fingers in between the throw and the catch of the bottle like this. Now let's add a spin to the bottle. So once again, let's start the move by trying just the bottle section. Get that single spin going and then bring the shaker into the swipe. So spin, shaker. Start slowly so you can get the rhythm and understand how the move works. And then once you've got it, you can start speeding up and getting that more of a loop, more of a rhythm going with this move. And then of course, with natural progression, try it with two spins. Now we're gonna throw the bottle inwards. So holding it down by our side, lift up and swing it inwards to create a backward spin and catching the same grab as before. Make the swipe through and repeat. As simple as that. And remember, you can always take away the shaker to practice the move without the swipe beforehand so you can understand how the move works, where your arm needs to go and how to make that full movement. Then bring the shaker back into play and start performing the move slowly until you build up your rhythm. Now changing the bottle grab back to tennis grab, we're gonna create a backwards reverse grab catch. So swing up, spin and a half to reverse grab. And again, try the move first, make the swipe, and slowly build up your rhythm until you can perform the move nice and smoothly. You can perform this move from any grab with the bottle. We're gonna start with the tennis grab. We're gonna throw the bottle for a single spin, tap the bottle and catch in reverse beer grab. Then from there, we can make our swipe through and perform the same move again from beer grab, tap, catch. And again, start slowly, build up that rhythm until you can perform this move smoothly and in a nice loop like this. And just keep going because the more you can perform it, the smoother it will get and the better you'll become. So this was one of my signature moves on stage and it's basically a gunsling, which is a thumb roll, finger roll, but across our body. So we come thumb roll, finger roll, down, and then once more, we're gonna practice down and then swipe through. And it's just looping that around. Thumb roll, finger roll, swipe. Thumb roll, finger roll, swipe. It looks good because the bottle is traveling in the opposite direction to the arm, so it creates a nice visual effect for the move. Finally, the over the shoulder swipe. Now there's many variations to this, but we're gonna just start easy. You're gonna learn the over the shoulder, and as you chop down, just the shaker comes up over the arm. So over the shoulder, down, and then cross over your arms, the shaker comes up. And once you get this one, you're gonna be able to do this one nice and smoothly and nice and quickly. If you wanna see more variations on the over the shoulder swipe, just let me know in the comments box below. Now you should go and check out this video on landing a bottle inside the shaker. You'll be able to link all of those moves together. But that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to hit subscribe, click the bell for notifications, smash that like button, and let me know if there's anything else you wanna see me teach you on the channel. But till next time, I'll see you then.